Yo dog, Snowflix Jeff here. This is just a PS4 Pro test of me using the new Elgato HD 60S Plus. I have to look at the case again. Um, this test is not through 4K, but this thing does accept 4K pass through at 60 FPS HDR. For recording, it goes up to 4K 30 FPS with HDR. But on this video specifically, I'll be recording 1920 by 1080 60 FPS with HDR enabled. Now I am recording through OBS, so you will not be able to see the effects of HDR. OBS cannot record HDR. In fact, your colors might look a little washed out, or there might be more contrast to what you're viewing because OBS does not record HDR. But the H but the pass through is HDR, so what I'm seeing is accurate, it is beautiful, it is bright as fuck. The darks are like something you've never seen before. Like this for me is really dark in the shadow, it looks awesome. The shade, I guess I should say. And it looks really bright out here in the sun, especially looking over there. But this test is to basically just check the bitrate. I'm running at near lossless quality. Of course, YouTube will dumb down the audio. I mean, the audio. YouTube will dumb down the video with its uh, encoder. I'm running this game on uh, prioritize uh, frame rate. That's what I was thinking. I'm prioritizing frame rate here. So the graphic quality is lowered. This is a PS4 Pro. It's for the 60 FPS sake. I think if you do prioritize graphics, it runs 30 FPS. Um, so yeah, basically I'm just checking the bitrate. Because it's supposed to be up to 60. A 20 improvement from the last model, which only went up to 40. And... I think that's about end of this test video. I'm going to leave the results in the description and the comments. Okay, I'm back, Jeff. Yeah, I'm doing another one because I changed some more settings. Um, okay. But yeah, this is the no reason I'm choosing this game. This game is shit. It's the only game I own that has HDR capabilities. Damn straight. Falling on budget.